Hi guys! So today we're on day 23 of our um, 30 day challenge for the youth group and I'm Annie and um, so today we're on day 23 and it goes over Philippians 3 through 4 and so I kind of read through it and wrote down some notes. So for Philippians 3 it talks a lot about being wary of evildoers and those who cause harm and how we need to accept the eternal life through Jesus and kind of um, like forget the old ways and um, just be cautious of those people who tell you that um, our human form is the best it can get because that's a lie. Um, and it also says like we didn't make it here on our own but God made us his own so um, we can't give ourselves credit for everything because we couldn't have done it without God. Philippians 4 is a pretty well-known chapter of the Bible, and um, in the very beginning, the uh, fourth verse says, Rejoice in the Lord always. Again, I will say rejoice. Let your gentle spirit be known to all men. The Lord is near. Be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving. Let your requests be made known to God. And the peace of God, which surpasses all comprehension, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Finally, brethren, whatever is true, whatever is honorable, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is of good repute, if there is anything excellent and anything praiseworthy, dwell on these things. And things you have learned and received and heard and seen in me, practice these things, and the God of peace will be with you. So, obviously, those verses are really well-known um, in church, and we've heard them a lot. But um, I think they still hold a lot of power because um, they tell us, like, we don't have to be anxious for anything. And I think that's really powerful. And, um, you know, it doesn't instantly cure our anxious feelings. But um, I think it can definitely help if we really believe those words. And um, I think verse 8, when it says, finally, brethren, whatever is true, whatever is honorable, whatever is right, whatever is pure, all those things that we should focus on, um, I think that's a pretty good guideline for our lives and how we interact with other people if we focus on those positive things. Um, I think God gave us some pretty good um, guidelines in that verse. So, and of course, in verse uh 13 of chapter 4, I can do all things through him who strengthens me. That's also a really common um, talked about verse. Um, and it's, it's also very encouraging because um, we realize that, you know, we can do anything. And um, I think we forget sometimes the capabilities that we have with God. And I think that's really important to always remember. 